I've watched the film Hate Mongers a number of times. I keep watching it over and over and I get new meaning every time I see it. It is one of the most influential films I have seen. People say you can do that when you watch movies. You grow, you get older, you come back to them. I haven't necessarily gotten that much older, but I've gotten a lot more insights into matter. So every time I look, I see something new. And I'd like to give you an interpretation of the film Hate Mongers. A central question to me is what was the underlying purpose of presenting the film? In one sense, you would think they made the film so they could show the story of Fred Phelps so the world could hear it. But it's not the typical story. It's not the story of somebody that wants to make a good impression on us and they say they don't care what we think. So why would they make the film? All throughout the film, they are trying to make themselves look good and try to give us their perspective. To me, it seems like they're trying to justify and validate their point of view. They are making an argument throughout the film. For example, they are making the argument that the anti-homosexuality crusade of theirs is biblically justified. And I definitely believe there's good biblical evidence for that. And furthermore, they are presenting the argument that it's a logical extension of their life approach, which started out as a civil rights crusade. But who are they trying to justify this with? To us? I don't think many people view the film and say, hey, they got a good point there. I'm totally convinced I want to join. Now that's what happened with Steve Drain when he made the film, but it's not what's going to happen with the average person or even the thoughtful person. They're not going to say, hey, that's a good point. Fred Phelps and his crew are very logical in their argument but that alone is not going to convince people of their point of view. And they even claim they don't want to convince people. So what's the point of such a film? Is it just an exercise in vanity? I believe ultimately the film is an effort for Westboro Baptist Church members to convince themselves of the validity and justification of their point of view. They are doing it for their own purposes. A lot of motivational speakers will say whenever you do a behavior it's about you not other people or when other people do a behavior it's about them not you and thus when Westboro Baptist Church members make a film like hate mongers they're trying to convince themselves and you hear all the time about how people will repeat things because they're convincing themselves they're insecure about it they need their own convictions validated